County Executive Chris Abley is not seeking re-election, so four people want that job. State Senator Chris Larson and State Representative David Crowley will advance to the April race. They both finished ahead of current County Board Chair Theodore Lipscomb and businesswoman Pernima Nath. 12 News' Derek Rose and Ben Wagner are following this race for us tonight. First, Derek is live at the Larson Camp near Walker's Point. Derek. Yeah, Joyce, it's been a night of celebration here for supporters of uh, State Senator Chris Larson in his victory and moving forward to the April 7th general election. Of course, this day started, as you mentioned, with four people on the ballot. Those numbers have now been uh, weaned down to just two candidates, State uh, Representative David Crowley as well as State Senator Chris Larson. After his victory speech here to supporters tonight, we got a chance to speak to him one-on-one -on -one, uh, as he outlined his vision moving forward between now and April. What's it going to take to get across the finish line to get your ultimate goal? Yeah, well, I think uh, we're going to continue to lay out, lay out a clear vision of where we stand on these issues. Um, it's going to be about making sure that we continue to build the coalition that we've got. Um, we have gotten the support of literally every single group that has endorsed so far in this race. Um, I'm proud of my grassroots support. We're going to continue to build it. We're going to continue to be in every nine, each of the 19 municipalities between now and April 7th. And he says there is a lot of work to do between now and April 7th. He said today was just the first hurdle in his campaign. He said tonight is for celebration, but tomorrow it is back to work to reaching that ultimate goal of becoming the next Milwaukee County executive. Live in Walker's Point, I'm Derek Rose, WISN 12 News. All right, thanks very much, Derek. Well, let's go live now to Ben Wagner at the David Crowley Watch Party in Bronzeville. Yeah, Patrick, it was certainly a party here tonight, but the guest of honor never arrived. State Representative David Crowley was on the floor in Madison here this evening, so he was unable to make his victory speech here tonight, though in his place was Glendale Mayor Brian Kennedy, along with Crowley's wife Erica, accepting and talking to a very motivated crowd here tonight with a number of big-name supporters. Bucks VP Alex Lazary here in attendance, one of those supporters. The Milwaukee County DA John Chisholm was also here as well. And... The current Milwaukee County Executive Chris Abley was here tonight. I spoke with him just a moment ago about some of the issues Milwaukee County is facing. What, what do you think that he could do to fix some of the other big problems that this county has? Well, one of the big issues, obviously, we have is uh, our revenue issue. I mean, it's not unique to the county. The city has the same issue. I continue to spend a lot of time uh, talking to legislators, and I will continue that in Madison. But if we're going to get an answer, we need a legislator who's not going to simply throw stones and point fingers and name ball. We need a legislator who's got a proven track record of getting things done with the other side. And I'll tell you, you go to Madison, you're not going to find anyone who dislikes David Crowley. And Chris Abel is actually in a similar position as David Crowley. He came in second in the 2016 primary only to beat State Senator Chris Larson in the April general election by about 30,000 votes. It is certainly something this campaign here hopes will happen here and will repeat itself here in the next few weeks. Reporting live here at MLK and North in Milwaukee, I'm Ben Wagner, WYSN 12 News. And Abley throwing his financial support behind Crowley as well. Thank you, Ben. Well,